Hey everybody, I hope you are having a great day and doing well. So, we are looking today at another liner. And this is Elf Expert Liquid Eyeliner in Jet Black. Alright. We've been doing a series of liners. And I think this is the last one I have for right now. Alright. So, it says no more tugging or pulling on your eyelids with this easy glide expert liquid li eyeliner. The smudge proof liner is rich in color, great, <coughs> excuse me, a long lasting defined look. The fine tip brush allows for effortless and precise application for natural, natural or dramatic eye looks. Directions apply to the lash line starting at the inner corner and working outwards. Position brush tip close to the lash lash roots and in a gentle fluid movement apply color along the natural curve of your lash line. Alright. So that is what it says about this. Alright. All right, now this is what we are going to do. This is net zero four, 14 fluid ounces or 4.2 milliliters. All right. All right, and this is jet black. All right. All right, everyone. And it is self clean, vegan, and cruelty free. All right. I'll see you guys on the other side. Okay, so before we get started, the first thing is uh, this was a surprise for me because most don't have these. Um, You'll see what I mean. Most don't have a brush. And this is a little teeny tiny brush. Alright. So be aware. And it's really. Really liquidy. This is the swatch. Alright. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. So we are going to get started. Uh, yeah, the brush really surprised me. It's really small. Okay, here we go. Hey, everyone. All right. So we are looking at Elf. Okay. This is the last liner I have of Elf that we are looking at. All right. All right, so um, I already said everything, all the information about the product, so we're just going to get started. All right, I'm running, not late, but I mean, family's here and lots of stuff, so. Okay, this is in jet black. Okay. All right. So I'm just going to get started. And we're going to, we are going to get started on this work. Look at this. I saw swatches. Oh my goodness. All right. So this is brand new. I'm opening the package. So we are going to see together what it is. Almost there. 
Alright, here we go, here we go. Okay, so so the packaging is sleek, black, I like that, it's pretty. Okay. And there really isn't any information on the back a little bit, that's it. Okay. But it is pretty, I like it. Alright, here we go. I'm going to swatch. Alright, so you can see before we line. Okay, and this looks like a brush. Interesting. I don't know if I like that. I haven't used a brush in years. We'll see. Alright, it is a brush. And that's the way it went on. Usually I've felt. So we'll see. Okay, here we go. Oh, the last time I used my, um, um, my, um, liner, I'm going to need to go get my, I have my waterline liner, it's kind of like a gauge, and, um, then we'll finish, just a minute. All right, so I got I got my mirror. <coughs> I apologize. Okay, so this is a brush, so it's going to be quite a bit different <laughs> than um, the felt. All right, so oh boy, I haven't had a brush in years, literally. I mean, I'm doing it again. Let's see. All right, I'm going to see if I can line in the black. There we go. Okay, I can feel it. I can feel the brush. Look at this. Look at the size of the brush. It's literally, it's, I mean, look at that. That's what I'm using. Okay. So I'm going a little bit above, like I do, so we can keep an eye on the product. All right, that, yeah. All right, that is all. And so I'm going to wrap up here and then we will get started. I'll see you on the other side. All right, so I love you all. All right, so I wanna show you again the brush. It really is small. Last time I used a brush, um, you know, it was um, not like this, but it was similar to use. All right, so this is the brush. All right, and I did do a swatch, but I'm going to thicken it, make it lar larger so you can see it more so. And this stuff is really, really liquidy. It's really, really wet when you apply, okay? Like when I first applied, I mean, it can easily, I mean, um, you know, be like a droplet. It's, you know, it's not doing that, but it could easily, easily do that. All right. So... There really isn't any claims. Just a minute. Let me look on the let me get the box. All right. So I stand corrected. 
No more tugging or pulling on your eyelids. This, with this Easy Glide Expert Liquid Eyeliner, the smudge proof liner is rich in color, creating a long lasting defined look. The fine tip, hmm, interesting. A uh, brush <coughs> allows for effortless and precise application for natural or dramatic looks. I don't know if I exactly agree with the fine tip. I don't know if I agree with that one. All right. I'll explain later. All right. So, um, you know, this again is the packaging that came in. This is what it says. Now, for me, um, the fine tip brush, the fine tip, that, that would apply uh, to more, to like felt. I didn't really think that the brush was like a fine tip. That's not a critique against the brush, but... I'm just saying a fine tip is more like a felt. All right. For effortless and precise application. I think felt tips give a more precise application, but I'll show you what I mean later. All right. So, um, it just says much proof. But it doesn't say how long. So we are just going. So we'll just meet up here at 10. And have a good day. <coughs> okay. So wait a minute. Getting started on our wear test. Before we do that. We are going to do this. It is right now. 1 o'clock. All right, so I'll see you sometime late tonight. So, everyone, have a great day, and I'll see you later. All right, everyone, I have an update. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> um, the liner uh, was coming off. Um, just a minute here. So, um, um, I had to redo it. Primer on, so I put primer on. Okay, and I'm going to reline right now, and then we will continue. If it does it again, then it's done. But we're going to reline right now. All right, here we go. And I'm lining again. I need to get really, really, really close. Running again. I thought it was coming off. And I did primer. I put my Milani primer on uh, this time. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes, all right? And yes, I know I've got that black mark. This is really, really wet. A wet brush, literally. It's been a long time. So, I did a thick line upwards the first time. That was gone. And it was almost down to my lash lines. So we will see, now that I've primed, if it makes a difference. All right, just a minute, let me look in my mirror. All right, I have some areas to clean, which I'm doing now. Right above my eye, there, there we go, because, there we go, better. All right, everyone. 
All right, I primered, so we'll see how it goes. So, all right, everyone, I will see you tonight. All right, <clears throat> excuse me. So I just wanted to give a quick update, and um, we are just going to keep going. Um, let's see. It is right now, and we're just going to keep going until 10, 2.30-ish. So a little bit before this, I had to uh, put primer on, and uh, we'll just uh, keep going, and um, I'll just keep an eye on things. So I just wanted to update you on what was going on. So I will see you guys at 10. So have a good day. Hey everyone, all right, so I am back a little early, but I, you know, know what the product is going to do, so it's 9-10, all right, and the product looks great. It has been the same. <laughs> Oh, I added primer. It was not added primer, so it definitely needs primer. I added some primer, but and then went over to just a little bit. <coughs> but it looks great, and it has since um, not too long after we started the wear test. So this is what's going on. I did a video to show you, and. Um, I'll, we'll talk uh, after this is over. Again, I'm going to let you know how everything is going. And as you can see, everything looks really good. Everything looks really good. Okay. Every, it's on. It looks good. So, the liner is getting a passing grade. So, I will see you guys on the other side. I love you all. All right. So, here's the deal. Um, <clears throat> the liner is getting, it needs primer. But the liner is giving an A because it it has lasted. It still looks good now, um, and I have no doubt into the next hour. Who knows how long? But it looks really good. And the reason why I've been doing video instead of photo is because I want to make sure. That you get a clear view, you know, of the liner, the product, whatever it is, that's why. So, now personally for myself, <coughs> I didn't really like the brush that well. I like the felt tip, but, but the product is good. The product's a good product. Um... You know, there's just things about the brush I don't like. Um, but the product itself does well. Um, it looks good. It looks really good. And um, it hasn't, you know, it hasn't moved. So, uh, you know, um, the product gets an A. All right. It gets an A. I think it's a good liner. All right. I really personally like the felt tip better. Um, there's reasons for that. Um, it's easier to line with than with a brush. And I definitely like um, my own uh, is matte. This is mine that I use, Milani Matte, which I like. I like the matte. But this 
is good too. I probably will not buy this liner again just because it's not my thing, but it's a good product. So this is more about, you know, preference. Um, you know, if I ha still have this liner, so if I wanted to wear it again, I can. And if I wanted to continue wearing it, I can. Um, I just really like Milani matte, so I stay with that. But it, this liner is a good liner also. So, um, <clears throat> you know, it didn't, of the claims here, um, you know, it says smudge proof liner. It didn't smudge. It is rich in color and it's long lasting. All right. Um, the thing I don't like about brushes, it's kind of like, um, <clears throat> Um, UD's liner, theirs is a brush, but the cap gets caught on the bristles. Now, that doesn't happen with this liner because of the way um, it's a pot liner, <clears throat> not a pen liner. But it doesn't do that with a felt tip, so that's why I prefer felt tip because <clears throat> none of the liner gets damaged when putting the top back on. <clears throat> All right, so... <clears throat> I think that's all for this video. Um, we've had an excellent wear test and the product is excellent and gets an A. So, um, um, you know, that's pretty much all for this video. So we have got a lot more, a lot more coming, all right? <clears throat> and I've got several um, shadows um, that we haven't looked at yet. I've got lots of stuff, a lot of stuff. So, all right, everyone. I love you all. Tomorrow is the 24th, which is Christmas Eve. Um, have a great, if I don't see you before Christmas, have a great Christmas Eve and a great Christmas. And, you know, just... Thank you for subscribing. I appreciate you. And thank you for being my subscribers. I love you. And to all my new subscribers, welcome. All right, everyone. I love you all. Have a great night and a great day tomorrow. And I will see you all in my next video.